Hey guys, in this video I'm going to be showing you guys one of the easiest ways to get a Lollibot without using Discord and this is through Beatbot and this will let you get a Lollibot through this website beatbot.xyz and I'll be putting this link in the description for you guys to use. So I'm going to be showing you guys in this video how to use it and what you can do with it and it's a pretty good Lollibot and this is just an update on the previous video I did of it. So without further ado, let's get right into the video. So to use Beatbot, what you want to do is go over to beatbot.xyz up here and I'll have this link in the description as well. And next thing you want to do is once you're over here, you want to go over to the login page right here by clicking on login. So there's going to be an instructions button right over here to log in to Beatbot. So what you want to do is click on the instructions button and then it'll send you this pop up. So the next thing you want to do is click on visit this page. You want to just click on this button right over here and this will send you to this page. So on this page, you can sign up with an Epic Games account or you can sign in with your Epic Games account. But make sure you're logged in with a secondary Epic Games account and not your main Epic Games account. Otherwise, this will kind of mess up your account. So what you want to do is if you don't already have a second account, click on sign up and you can sign up with email or any of these. But I already have an Epic Games account, so I'm just going to sign in. And again, make sure that was your alt Epic Games account and not your main. Otherwise, this is not going to work. So what you want to do is you see where it says authorization code, you can copy this text right over here and then you can go back into Beatbot, click on next and then you want to just paste it into here and make sure that this is the code in this area over here or it's the code in this area and don't copy the entire page. So next thing you want to do is just click on next and then it'll say you're all set and you've been logged into Beatbot. So now that you're in Beatbot you will have all of your commands right over here. So next thing you want to do is you want to launch up Fortnite. This can be on a console, Switch, uh, Xbox, PS4, or you can do it on your computer, or you can also do it on mobile. So anything that runs Fortnite, you can use. So once you're into here, you want to go over to your friends list, go over to your ads friends thing over here, and then you just want to add the friend, which is the bot. So if you remember what your bot's name was or the display name of your bot when you logged in you can use that so mine's called excel test bot so i'm just befriending that so now i can just add him like this and then right when you add the friend the bot will instantly accept your friend request so you can see it just accepted my friend request and now what you want to do is go back into the beatpot page just like this and then you can do all these commands on it so first thing you want to do is just invite it to your party. So you'll see it over here and it should say, it should have Beatbot in its status. So just invite it to the party like that. And then once it's in the party, you can just go back over here and you can change the skin, change the emote and all of these. So we'll do the skin first so you can make it Renegade Raider if you want. Just like that. And then it'll change to Renegade Raider. You can change the emote. You can make it do the floss emote if you want to. And then it'll do the floss emote. You can change the backpack to Bonesy, just like it says here. And then that'll make it Bonesy backpack. And then you can also change the variant and the level. So we'll first go through the level. The level, you can just type in any number. So you can see that it's currently at level one. And then if you type in 99, it'll change it to 99. And then you also change the variant. So since the Renegade Raider has the default and checkered variant, you can change it to the checkered variant and you get the checkered variant of the Renegade Raider. And then if you want it to just be normal again, you can just change it to default and then it'll be the normal default variant. So you can do this with skins like the Clark Kent skin if you want to. So you can change it into Superman. So once you get Clark Kent, you can make him into Superman by going back over here, going to the variants and then changing him to Superman like that. And then you can also change his color to shadow. And then you'll get the shadow version of Superman. So you can do this with skins like the Ghoul Trooper by just typing in Ghoul Trooper and then changing the skin to pink. And you can do it with pretty much any skin in the entire game. So another great thing about this Lollibot is that it does not expire. So as long as you leave this tab open on your phone or on your computer, it'll stay online and you can invite it to your party whenever you want. So thank you guys for watching and hope you guys enjoyed the video. If you did, make sure you guys leave a like and subscribe and I'll see you guys in the next one.